Hello friends, several days ago Juno Network launched the mainnet and now the first proposal is in voting period so we need to vote for the first proposal. I will explain you how to vote for the proposals in the Juno network. It's very easy. At first you need to have Kepler wallet extension. All information will be in the description of the video. Go by the link. I already have Kepler extension. If you don't have Kepler extension, web page will ask you to upload it. And don't use Firefox or any other browser. Use only Chrome browser because in the other browsers it can be fake version of Kepler wallet you can input Kepler extension in any search and you will see Chrome Google Kepler you will see more than 100,000 users blah 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 all information so it's a trustable after you upload the Kepler extension you will have a lot of networks and you need to to choose Juno network. It will open from the Cosmos network and you can don't see the Juno. If you don't see Juno, you need to add Juno network to the Kepler. At first you can go to Osmosis. When you come to Osmosis, Osmosis automatically connected with the Kepler wallet extension and you need to add Juno to the Kepler. For this you find here Juno and click deposit. I already add Juno network to my Kepler extension so Osmosis don't ask me about uh, adding the network. In your case if you never had Juno before in the Kepler it will be new window and you need to click approve approve. So after you will approve adding of Juno network to the Kepler extension, you will have here Juno network. It's in the beta support for now, soon it will be in the main support, but it's not really important. Next step that we need to do to buy Juno. How to understand uh, what is the price of the Juno. Exist two very cool dashboards for Juno. First made by the validator imperator they are also from distributed validator symptoms and uh, they create cool dashboard for the osmosis decks and uh, here in the tokens you always can click on any token you want and the get information as you can see now is very good price to buy juno it was up to ten dollars after goes down and if we will look at the minimum it's uh, something like a three here's 373 so i think it's a good moment to buy juno also exists another cool dashboard from the bro and bro validator it's a group of people who validate and juno and osmosis very nice people always help to the community they create more technical dashboard here you can see the price of the juno and all other stats and you see one active proposal it means that we can vote for it and uh, this is important to participate in the governance of the network because every word will be heard. So, after you know everything about Juno, let's buy Juno. You can buy Juno for the any of other tokens that you can find at Osmosis. Let's it will be for the Atom. Go to your Kepler wallet extension, open your Cosmos chain. Here is you can see your address and uh, I already have available atoms on my address. 100 atoms I need to return back to the community pool and to Tendermint and 5 atoms is my atom. I deposit here 5 atoms and click deposit. Kepler wallet asks do I really want to deposit atoms and here is several different possibilities to deposit atoms with the different fees. If you want fast choose average fee, approve. I'll wait for the transaction to be included into the block. Congratulations! You can see your transaction in the Explorer. You can see that we was transferring from address in Cosmos network to another address in Osmosis network by the channel one for one with amount of five atoms. We go here and we see five atoms already in our balance. We click on trade here atom and here we choose Juno. We click max and uh, here is the price. Five 
atoms for now it's a 43 juna very good we click swap now small hint you can little bit up the gas but if the fee is zero it's not important how big gas fee always will be zero zero multiply on any number always will be zero very great that you can make zero fee transactions at osmosis so after we change atom to juna go to your assets you will see zero atom and you will see some juna now we need to withdraw juna from the osmosis decks click withdraw max withdraw kepler ask us about the commission set gas price little bit bigger go to the omniflix dashboard for the juno this is dashboard it's automatically connected to the kepler and shows what do you have we can see that uh, we have available tokens we have staked tokens we have a revert and we have zero unstaked tokens so if you want to undelegate here is will be the number of undelegated tokens but for now if we will look at juna stats ipr it's 192 percent it's really good person so stake your juna and remember that to undelegate juna you need not 21 day but 28 days so i can see that i delegated to posthuman validator because i am a posthuman delegator but we will delegate not only to me let's delegate to somebody else click on the stake tokens and choose some validators at first let's choose omniflix validator because omniflix validator is the creator of this dashboard and it's nice to support people who really support community. Some problems with the showings of the logo. I don't know why, but I hope Omniflix will fix it. We will uh, delegate 11 tokens. Kepler asks us, here is the low commission, average and high commission. Let's click low commission and see what will be. We need to wait something like a seven seconds. We can see on this, this beautiful dashboard that the current block time it's a six seconds. Very nice. Done. Also, we don't see the Omniflix validator here. Let's refresh or oh, and now we can see everything is good with the logos now. Let's delegate our tokens to some more validators because when you delegate to several validators you prevent the centralization bro and bro they create very cool dashboard let's delegate them also 11 tokens stake it works also with small commission very good i will show you the list of validators that are useful for the community very nice to stick to Imperator. Small problem of this dashboard, we don't have a search by the name, but in future it will be. Stake 11 Juna to Imperator Validator. Imperator Validator creates this beautiful page for Osmosis. Bro and Bro creates this. Omniflex creates this. And also, let's take a little bit to validator CyberG. CyberG and Web3 Forever, they also help the community a lot. And they made um, very interesting workshops, how to deploy smart contracts. They do a lot of technical moments and they help the community with a lot of technical questions. And uh, this is said that we often see front end, but very rare see the back end. And these validators, CyberG and uh, Web3 Forever, they do a lot for the community on the back side web3 forever very good we find web3 forever 11 tokens take approve done let's refresh the page and we will see that now we have the really great list of the really cool validators after you delegate juno you became a delegator and uh, delegators this is the people who support the network 
because if you delegate your tokens you tell my own economical interests it's not so important how the to develop the network and provide the security to the network because of it network will reward you with uh, reward in juno and also you will have not only reward but you will have right to vote because if you bring benefits of value to the network network will bring benefits of value to you we see top active proposals now it's number one we can read what's about this proposal core development team proposal to locate 1 million Juna for Atom Juna and uh, Osmo Juna pools on Osmosis. If you want, you can click on it and read more. What the main reason of it? If we will go to the Osmosis, we will see pools. And here is in the pools exist two categories of the pools incentivized pools and not incentivized pools. We can find here pool Juna Atom and pool Juna Osmo. If we will look at TVL of these pools, Atom Juna it's near 2 millions, in Juna Osma it's 1 million with something. So if this proposal will pass, and I show that it will, in these pools will be much more Juna, it will be bigger liquidity and it will be much more cheaper to exchange Osma to Juno and Atom to Juna and back. So we totally support this and also at 15th of October it will be incentivized pools with Juna. Here is different incentivized pools. Atom Osmo, Ion Osmo, XPRT Osmo, Atom IO, IO Osmo and you can see APR here. It means if you provide liquidity to these pools you will get not only the percent for the exchange but you also will get additional Osmo. This is very nice and great, so we are totally supported. When you read what's about the proposal, click on yes. Of course you can vote no, no with veto or abstain, but it's like vote against yourself. So vote yes, and as you can see, for now 100% of all people who was voting was vote yes. And the voting period will be until the 9th of October. Confirm. Kepler will ask you, do you really want vote yes for the proposal number one? We say, of course, yes. In memo, you can write anything or write nothing. I will write post human votes yes for the proposal number one in Juno. Click approve. Your vote is taken. We can click on the details, see the results. You voted yes for this proposal. So that's all. It's very easy to vote for the proposals in Juna. Join the community in the Telegram. Link will be in the description. You can see the very active community. Already 3000 members. Always discussion, some funny jokes, memes. Feel free to join Russian speaking community if you speak on the Russian language. Here maybe not so big community but the same active and we always translate the news into Russian about Juna and uh, if you want to know more about Juna visit the web page junachain.com and here is you can find information about documentation about what's happening how to build smart contracts on Juna and uh, maybe you also have a stake drop from the Juna network you just need to copy your address from the code Cosmos network, input it here and you will see how many Juna you will get from this stake drop. Stake drop only for those persons who delegated Atom at the moment of 18th of the February 2021. It was the time of the launching of IBC. So friends, see you soon. Delegate to the post-human validator. Delegate to all others validators. Uh, bring more decentralization to the network. Create your smart contracts with Junum network. It's very easy.